tell you? You were in my dreams last night, Watcher. You were on your knees before my God. And I couldn't stop screaming. Incense? Offerings for the temple? Payment for heads. It could be no simpler, I say. My apologies, I didn't see you there. Didn't you? I, like the other scholars here, am engaged in the study of the soul sciences. Was there something you needed, or may I return to my studies? Indeed. I apologize if you find the sight of blood unsettling. Though, from your appearance, I would expect you to be well acquainted with it. In any case, why are you here? Just a bit of culture I've picked up along the way. I admire their tailoring tradition immensely. It's much grander than clothing one finds in the white that wends. I am, of course. A curious mind is an agile mind. Besides, the two practices are more alike than one might think. Care and patience, yes. It is gratifying to be understood. It is a mundane story. I sought out the ship with the longest overseas route departing from the Republic's and book passage. I had intended to perform a handful of experiments regarding the nature of souls that could only be done safely at sea. A fellow researcher, then perhaps you will understand. I've long been fascinated by the nature of entropy. Nothing is unaffected by the passage of time, excepting souls, supposedly. Is it not possible that repeated reincarnation damages a soul? Could the process of reincarnation itself be responsible for some of the many ills that plague the souls of Kith? I deduced that it was possible to escape the cycle, escape Bareth's grasp, to remove one's soul from the wheel. I suppose I was wrong to expect more from you. If... if you insist. With the aid of a device of copper in Audra, I have uncoupled my soul from my body, freeing myself of Barris' wheel. I belong only to myself now. The 
You... do? Perhaps you would be amenable to me traveling with you. On something of a permanent basis? I have a vested interest in Luminous Audra, but acquiring it here can be expensive. You have a ship of your own and are clearly well-traveled. I suspect I would encounter more Luminous Audra with you than I would on the streets of Nekataka. Truly? How could we possibly live to regret this? No, I'm... I'm actually curious. Thaklaut, Traveler. I am grateful. I have all that I need. You may depart at your leisure. As you say, Captain. What is it? I'll take care of it. <laughs> 